Hello, my name is Rachel and I just got back from the Gothic Cruise and it was once again an amazing time and <laughs> I do feel like this year I was maybe a little <laughs> a little more tired, a little slower in keeping up, but I was on night shift last year so it was easy. Our parties start at midnight and they go to 4 a.m. So last year since I was still on night shift it was so much easier to keep up with that schedule. This year I did struggle a little but I, and I slept more during the day which means I didn't do as many daytime activities but I still made, I think I made all of the nighttime parties and I think I only retired early one of the nights. The rest of the nights I did manage to make it to the end of the party and our amazing cruise I guess director the person who puts together the gothic crew she you know she's the one who you have to go through her to book it she books all the bands she works with the cruise line to get us all of our perks and private parties since the ship doesn't really have food after like midnight unless you order in room service which has a very limited menu she got the ship to open up their little pizza stand, uh, like, you know, buffet at 4 a.m. every morning for us. So we had pizza at 4 a.m. every morning, and I made it to the pizza almost every morning. I think I, I missed out on, uh, like I said, the one. <laughs> but I think, I think Bryant made it to that one. So I think he made it to all the pizza parties. <laughs> But I, I, st I still like, I still managed to make it through and so I've been home for what, four days? I feel like I've slept the entire four days that I've been home. Oh my goodness. Oh, it doesn't get any easier as you get older, I tell you. But still, it's, it's my absolute, like one of my absolute favorite things to do. The people are amazing. Uh, many of my favorite people in the world are there and I got to, you know, it's one of the few times I get to see them a year because we live all over the country and in some cases all over the world <laughs> and it was it's just such an awesome amazing experience and I, I mentioned in some of the other videos where I talked about the cruise that the next one actually isn't going to be until February of, or no March March of 2024 because they wanted to move it from September to March so it's just a little bit more than a year away from now and the lineup for that's gonna be Combi Christ, Rotter Sand, and Dissector. And if you go down into the description box and find the Gothic Cruise webpage link and go, go onto the page and find the survey and you fill out that survey, you're entering to win a cabin on the next Gothic Cruise. And I think that's absolutely awesome. Maybe I'll get to see one of uh, you guys on the next Gothic Cruise 2024. And also another exciting thing like I was just talking about Zeta who puts it all together. She had asked me to be her social influencer and and I'm like, I just do this for fun. I, I have a really small following. I don't think I'm really what you need for that. So I made a suggestion to her and they did sign a contract. So Zeta did sign a contract with the person that I suggested and I don't know if I'm allowed to announce it yet so I'm not gonna say anything because I, uh, um, I'll have to wait until they actually start doing the influencing on it. <laughs> but it, I know it's someone that a lot of you follow and really enjoy, so I'm really excited and I can't wait till she starts doing the, the Gothic Cruise content. <laughs> and uh, I'm, I'm excited to, to get to, to you know, see her on the 2024 cruise. <laughs> So that, that was really fun and exciting. And it was really sweet of Zeta to ask me to do it, but I'm like, you know, you get, I only have just under 3,000 followers and you get generally less than 10% engagement. So if I'm lucky, I get like 300 views for an average video. I mean, there are definitely outliers that get a couple thousand views, but you know, you know what I mean. So I just, I just wanted her to have someone who could have real reach um, and, and uh, you know, a real influencer. <laughs> But still, I was flattered that she asked. Okay. Also, Zeta is working with the company that does things like the Metal Cruise, which is a whole ship charter cruise where, you know, because right now it's we're a group on a ship with like a thousand other normal people, regular people. But the, the company she's working with is the type of company that charters the entire ship so that it becomes a like a music festival on the sea. Like the Metal Cruise, I think, has like 40 bands that play and it's you book it knowing it's the Metal Cruise and that's what that's all that's going to be. So only people interested in that thing are going to book it. So she's working with that company and hopefully in the next, I think she said three to four years, we might be able to... Uh, they, they might, depending how like the survey goes and some other stuff goes they uh, might take over 
and turn this into like a basically a like gothic festival on the sea which I think would be absolutely amazing I'm really excited about that idea and I really hope that that works out enough about that as usual I did put together a vlog for you guys um it's one of my usual terrible vlogs where it's just a a mismatch of video clips and photographs but I hope it captures how much fun I had and then just how amazing this cruise is and also there were the three bands that played and I took a lot of footage of the bands but I've only put very small clips into this vlog video so I'm probably going to publish some extra supplemental videos that are just the band like one for each of the three bands that play just the clips that I took of them just so if you are interested in seeing more of that band perform you can get a better taste for it because I didn't you know I didn't film their entire set but I would just film like a minute from this song or 30 seconds from that song you know just to and I might put all that together into separate just supplemental videos just if anyone's interested in that sort of thing but here is my vlog I hope you enjoy it okay guys so this is day one we're at the hotel this is day zero, this is day zero. we're at the hotel and uh, tomorrow we actually leave for the cruise. So I just thought I'd show you a little bit of the, the pre-gathering here. And then tomorrow we actually board the ship. So I'll be show I'll be trying to remember to show you all of that. Okay guys, so here is our room. <laughs> See, I already have drinks. <laughs> Some mirror, some random artwork, huge mirror behind the bed. There's our bed. And if you saw my uh, Gothic cruise video from last year, you'll you'll notice that this room is quite a bit smaller than that room. That was a balcony room. This is an interior room. Interior rooms are less expensive, and I of course wanted to get the least expensive option possible this year because of you know the lack of job situation, but. It's a nice little room, and uh, yeah. This looks like giant SpaghettiOs, but it's actually calamari salad. And here we are doing rainbow shots with some non-Gothic cruisers. Always fun to uh, mingle with the regulars.
I think this poor little bird got a concussion from flying into the glass, but after resting for a little while on the side of the ship, he finally flew away. Hey guys, so I forgot my sunglasses. <laughs> Barely see anything. But we are at the private island today, and uh, we're going to put on our swimsuits and head down there in a minute, but I'm just gonna show you a little bit of footage of that real quick. So finally made it out to the private island and we're at a, a bar. Let me show you what's going on here. We're on, still on the island. Uh, we're at another part of it. We're on the beach near the ship. So let me just show you a little bit of this. Still on the same island, more beach and more bar. Let's take a look. Hey guys, so I'm actually at the casino and I'm playing the funny little bulldozer game. So I just thought I'd show you all that. Oh, and look, Bryant won 10 cents. No, oh, I, this is all that was left of my dollar. <laughs> oh, that was all that's left. So he has a voucher to go cash out for 10 cents. <laughs> okay, let's, let's play this game. I have no idea if you guys are going to be able to hear me talking with this loud music playing, but tonight is a concert night. So we're getting both obstacles and ego like this, and of course I'll get a few clips of them playing live. So we will hopefully get to that here shortly. The clip you are about to see is of the Gothsicles, and they put on such a, an amazing, energetic, fun live show. So I hope you enjoy this short clip.
And next up is ego likeness. So you're going to see some live footage of them. They were absolutely amazing as always. One of my absolute favorites. Next up is some live footage of Stone Birder, and he does such an amazing show. Um, so hopefully you guys enjoy this as well. So today we are in Costa Maya, and I'm going to show you the um, the shore and everything that's here, but uh, we're not getting off the boat today, but I will show you from the ship our view. And there's a little amusement park over there that uh, looks like um, some ruins. <laughs>
And here we are at Cozumel. Unfortunately, COVID did find its way onto the ship and a couple of people in our group did end up testing positive, but I tested when I got home and yay, no COVID for me. Um, probably had a little extra immunity from just having it back in the end of July. So that was all the fun I had. I hope you really enjoyed watching my little vlog. I know I'm, I'm so terrible at vlogging. <laughs> But it's all fun and I hope like I said I was able to capture that fun and that you guys were able to get an idea of that fun <laughs> and again go down to the description box go to the Gothic Cruise web page find the survey fill it out and you could be entered to win a cabin on the next Gothic Cruise in 2024 with Combi Christ Rotter Sand and Dissector and that would be amazing wouldn't it and if you enjoyed the video please give it a thumbs up if you didn't enjoy the video, of course you can give it a thumbs down and please tell us all about it in the comments below. And please subscribe to the channel. And I hope everyone is just staying happy, healthy, and safe in this incredibly crazy world we're living in. And I will talk to you all soon. Bye-bye.